always hard for me to make breakfast every morning. I am my most productive with a YouTube video in the background. SyncWire allows me to watch YouTube and stay productive without the distraction of the television across the room. SyncWire has an upright double stand that is mag safe and is so versatile that it can move in any direction. As a bonus, SyncWire can attach to any iron metal surface such as my refrigerator, allowing me more space to be productive. If you're having trouble staying productive, definitely check out SyncWire below in my description box. Thank you, SyncWire. Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog vlog. Let's go get this work in the gym, baby. It's his birthday week, y'all. A vlog will be coming. I'm actually in the process of editing his video, his last video right now, which is actually kind of annoying because his video is really resistant to me editing it. Like I tried to send it through this AR editor that I'm using and y'all, I had to edit it the whole thing by hand like man tell them about the 11 yeah, 11 yeah, billion yeah, packages yeah. you ordered oh yeah we we ordered packages for amazon we, prime well well we both did but i ordered more because i had to get in birthday presents and stuff so uh i'm gonna show y'all how much how many packages we got when we get home and of course we're gonna be having an unboxing this week i don't know when because i got a lot going on like back to back stuff i always i'm always doing something every day so i don't know when all this stuff is gonna get unboxed, but it's gonna get unboxed. Okay, right? to the gym we go. Hey y'all, so we're about to get ready and go to the movies to start off Joe's birthday weekend. Right now I'm just wearing a casual outfit. I'm just gonna wear some, wear this basics top. This basics top with um, dragon pants and then I'm gonna get like a little, um, put it on the bag of toys today. All right y'all, we're in the car so we headed to the movies now we're going to see twisters it's one of the newest movies that just came out it came out today right yep it was this uh or go get red panda y'all seen red panda before but y'all i don't know y'all remember it it's like the noodle place red panda noodles but yeah so we decided to um well he decided to do movies because it is his birthday weekend so his actual birthday is on sunday the 21st so how old are you, Tony? 24. Old. Oh. Uh. Just like me. So are you ready? Three, two, one. Welcome to our show. This is Kari and Mo. Today we're going through packages. Mini a package. 
we have all the packages okay this is from our prime day haul as you can see we have a mixture of birthday gifts and you know things i wanted and needed this is going to be fun guys but on our series today kari and i will be building our new shoe shelf not shoe shelf our new shoe uh, storage and it has a bench on top so we can sit on it and we also will have a mirror that will go up on the wall so we're excited you excited for building look at that little toe of course he is of course he is he loves to work with mommy of course he is <laughs> okay okay ah, okay okay ah. my poor arm I wasn't even doing nothing, I was just posing. Why you not? Alright, guys, here are the results. Okay, see on top of it. And it's 30. And cars, me and Kari built it, or I built it, with the supervision of Kari, so, yeah. That's gonna be it for right now. Um, I wanna take a nap. I'm kinda tired now from putting this together. It didn't take that long, it took like what? Oh, like 30 minutes? Yeah. Maybe, 45 minutes? About time for your nap time too. We'll see y'all later. Hey y'all, back home. Um, I went to Dollar Tree before um, coming back. So let's go over what I got. And if y'all always wonder why I always take my shirt off, when I like this specific shirt is when I come from work. So it has the name of where I work. So I always take it off. But um, yeah, let's go over what I got from Dollar Tree. I went and picked up some um, things for Joe's birthday. So I got this bow. I don't know why I only got one bow. Currently warming up dinner. But yeah, I only got one bow. I plan on putting it on the bag that's in the front. So it shouldn't really be a big deal. I got some um, glitter some gift tissue paper to put in his basket. Uh, got him his birthday numbers. I got a little like tablecloth to go over this, to go over the um, the bar table. That's what I'm gonna do set up. And then for the second bag stuff, um, we got and I, if I haven't told y'all already, I'm making him a um, like a, a gift basket kind of of like essential nurse stuff that I found on Amazon that I thought he could use. Um, Dollar Tree. Um, I didn't want to get one of the plastic baskets just because I feel like it looks kind of cheap. So I wanted to go with this wire basket instead. And then I got some bags. I got I went with silver because these were only the only basic bags that they had at, at Dollar Tree. Like all the other ones were like super artistic and super colorful. And I just I wanted to go, to go with the vibe, so I just got the silver one that I knew would work. I'm trying to figure out if I want to do it tonight or if I'ma wait to I might wait until early morning of his birthday to do it actually i think i'm gonna get up early and do the decorations so that he can walk out to the decorations yeah i'm about to eat dinner and then i'm gonna try to get some more stuff done on my list tonight so that i don't have to focus on any of that this weekend and yeah i'll see y'all in the a.m for day two of his birthday again.
Good morning, y'all. Happy Friday. No, happy Saturday. Today is the 20th. Um, uh, it is currently 9.23. I've been up since like 7 o'clock. Um, yeah, this, this dog got me feeling so sick right now. He's been making this throw up noise all morning. And I'm somebody that gets queasy easily when somebody else is about to throw up. So, um, yeah, I'm about to get something to drink right quick because I can literally feel myself wanting to throw up because he keep on making these noises. So, I think I'm going to do some um, electrolytes. Maybe that'll help. Actually, no. Let's make some tea. Because I already have some water ready. And I don't know about that. I told you guys. Well, I did. I think I did. But I got this electric kettle. So, um, yeah. This is what I've been using more so for the summer. Because I don't really drink coffee as much in the summer. So, I was like, let me... Let me get me an electric, you know, uh, tea kettle or whatever. So, that is what we're drinking. Boys to the Yogi brand because they um, have caffeine free options. So, this one supports healthy, healthy digestion. And I always love these because they have like a, like a Yogi quote or whatever. So today says, without without the storms and rain, life would cease to be. One thing I'll tell y'all about electric kettle, it it cooks like it boils fast. Like I literally just turned that on a minute ago, and the water is already at 130 degrees. And I usually have my my tea kettle set to 180, so that it's actually kind of like in between warm and hot because if you put it at like 130 then it's gonna be like lukewarm almost all right guys so we have our tea um, I actually wanted to unbox the mirror that I got to go with the new bench. I did get some more packages in the mail, but I think these packages are from brands. So I have to open them up um, later today. But um, we did end up getting another package from a brand yesterday. So I opened that last night. We're going to have to make content. We're going to be making content, not have to. We'll be um, making content for those brands sometime next week going on and stuff but yeah i'm hoping that this tea helps settle my stomach see what the mirror talking about okay i actually love this for me like actually making this place look like how i want it to to the store and pick up a couple more like picture hanging scripts all right y'all i'm at walmart um car is back there as you can see y'all watching for me i'll be right back it'll be fine it stinks out here it's more like eggs
I think he is. He in the front seat. All right, you leaking. Sit over there. All right, y'all, we about to head to, I want to say the other Walmart, but, child, it's hot out here. Hey, y'all, I'm about to get ready. So, um, we're going to this Barnes & Nobles. Joe loves books, so I want to take him to the largest Barnes & Nobles in, um, in Orlando, so. He thinks that we're going to our regular Barnes and, and Barnes and Nobles, but really we're not. So I'm sure he'll be surprised once he gets there to see how big it is. But yeah, let me figure out what I'm gonna do with my hair because it's kind of fuzzy. Be in the library, I mean, not a library. Bookstore? Yup. Huh? That's what I was saying, where I started. You want to ride the escalator? Oh, yeah. It's cool. <coughs> when, I, when, I got, when I get my joke cave. Not a typewriter. All right, y'all, we're in the largest Barnes and Nobles in Orlando. Y'all, it is so big. Like, y'all can see the, the escalator behind us. She, she planned this. Yeah, I planned this. It was a trap. Yes. Yes, it is. So, we're just gonna walk around, see what books. Oh, that book series. Where we found that at? The Thorns and Roses one? Or what, the one that, that, um. It's somewhere. We just gotta look. All the fantasy stuff is more this way. So, Narnia was so good. I, I love Narnia. I read the book before. Oh, he got the Doom series. It looks so good. Got it. Got Emperor of Doom, Chapter House. This is the Sarah Mass books we were talking about, y'all. This is the one Jordan was talking about on her blog, The Throne of Glass. Hey y'all, so we're leaving Barnes and Nobles now. Had such a good time. I ended up getting um, the soup cookbook that you guys saw. Y'all, they have a recipe for every day of the year. Like, I'm 100% about to make, make back, not make back, but like use what the book, what it was worth, you know? I think the book was like $30, but soups for 365 days you get that you know you get more value out of it than how much you paid for it you know so um yeah i got that and then joe got three books he got a stephen king book um you got the sarah moss book and then what else um a good girl's guide to murder yeah good girl's guide to murder which was very like crazy like so i see that now we're headed to Panera, Panera, Panera Bread. We're taking you out. Hey 
Hey y'all. So we're headed to the spa retreat at Bella Clina. Um, we just left the house. I decided to change bottoms. I had on the skirt earlier, but honestly I was tired of the skirt. So I went ahead and did pants and it still looked good with it. I am wearing Joe's pants though. So like, I'm not sure if these pants make me look in the water. Well, no, they don't make me look in the water. They kind of like a, like a Capri linen pants on me versus, I don't know if they shrunk a little. those my pants. Yeah. I don't know if they shrunk a little in the dry or what. You gotta tell me whenever you put them back on. Um, but yeah, so we had to do it now. I'll let y'all know when we make it. Fun to get there at five. Yeah, oh. we are lost in in this amazingly beautiful place. <laughs> Can't you be mad for real? Um, but yeah, so everything looks nice out here. Like it literally gives you like vineyard vibes but yeah we're lost so we're trying to find our way to the actual spa now because this just took us to the golf slash residence part so i don't know because this ain't this where we came from though yeah i'm about to end up calling him unless it unless it yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. too different behind it right behind it no because that's, that's where we came from So we're in our baths now. The massage was so good. I don't have my camera right now, so I'm on my phone. Man, I feel like a new man. Yeah, it's so good. Feel brand new. But yeah, y'all, like it went so good. We're doing our bath now. And I think it's, it's like one or two more things to do. So, and excuse my, I got chocolate. We had chocolate covered strawberries, y'all. What's up, gang? Let's close this right quick. We're back in the crib from the um, the spa day, and y'all, it was so good. Um, I have to say, I definitely will go back, or we will definitely go back, probably next time for a, a, like a sports massage. This one was like their signature massage. Hey, y'all. So I decided to go ahead and his birthday basket that I told y'all I was gonna do. Let me take these headphones off because I feel like I'm talking loud because they're muted. But um, yeah, we're about to do that right quick right now. He's absolutely infatuated with that football game that just came out. Good job. But anyway, um, I'm about to get ready to do that. I locked the door so he can't get in.
All right, y'all, the mirror is up. It looks so good. Um, here is the full space with the shoe bench and then the plant right next to it. I just feel like it just made the walk-in area, you know, more aesthetic, more dramatic. But yeah, y'all, um, that is this new setup. It looks good so far. Like I said, it's about to get turned into a home and that's period. Hey y'all, I'm about to put Joe's um, birthday set up together. It is currently like 10.30 right now, he's asleep. So I'm gonna get some clips for y'all on his camera and then I have my camera set up right here. So yeah, let's get to work. All right y'all, let's get into it pretty quick. Um, he's sleeping right now, so gotta be quick. on the side his nurse's prayer his um actual like little basket set up i did some confetti on the part right here and then we did like an arch going over top so it, the balloons aren't all the same size but that part doesn't matter it looks good i did a gold tablecloth and in the morning we want to get his cake so and y'all y'all gonna be y'all gonna be lit y'all gonna be lit when y'all see this cake Cause your girl didn't come to play this year yeah that took like an hour to do the longest part was definitely the balloon arch that took the longest but it was worth it it came out so good but yeah i'm gonna see y'all in the morning all right ready yeah i guess you can come out too huh bye bye hey, time to do all this. just be up to Stab you. I gotta keep an eye on you. Why? We had time to do all this. I told you I had stuff to do. I told you I was busy. Too busy. I forgot his water was under there. I put his bowl under there and stuff. I'm not running out of the hand sanitizer anytime soon. Citrus grove, frosted mint. Lemon lime spritz. Okay. All right, guys. Opening his last present. Y'all see the bracelet? His parents actually yeah, he got him this bracelet. It's so nice. Okay. Shoes. Oh, you gotta tell. You gotta use the new bitch, y'all. He used in the new setup. You see it, y'all see the setup. It just look too good. Y'all gonna be seeing me taking a lot of pictures in this mirror right here, baby. Look, Kari, don't match your shoes. You just invested in this. This new stuff. It's exciting going on. 
when they just, he just probably just, he just hungry. He want to eat, ready to eat. Like, Dad, take me outside. Well, you can't eat my shoes. Feel good already, then I even broke in. You like them? Yeah, good. Alright, y'all, we're going to get the cake. I was supposed to go pick that up at 8.30, so well they just opened, so yo. Y'all get ready. Big cake, baby. It's about to be lit. You ready to see your cake? Yeah, lay down. Alright. Come on. Hey y'all. But yeah, I got in the car and he's, he's over here whining while I'm trying to talk on the phone. But yeah, I was just telling Joe that I can't pick up the cake and these niggas talking about they don't got the order. Like I, I talked to the two different stores, y'all, two different publicists. And they told me they don't got the order, so I had to call the public that I talked to. They said they don't got the order. So the dude, he said he gonna order, he gonna, he put the order in for me. So now I gotta come and pick the order up again. Come back again, but I gotta go to the college park location and pick up the order. I'm just glad he didn't say some, some stuff like, oh, well, there's nothing we can do. I would've been even more pissed off if he would've said that. But yeah, I'm, I'll be home in a minute. All right, guys, finally got some new curtains. The birthday boy is helping. These are dirty anyway, so they need to go. They need to be washed. I'm gonna order another one. curtains they look good but like I said they only sent me one I did not know it was just one they, they dark out they long though so they reached the floor Do y'all change I'll buy another the other set eventually all right y'all I took a little nap because your girl was tired literally um been going, going, going all week um, with everything I've been doing for his birthday and Prime Day, shipping, packages, brands. So, yeah. But I feel like after you get like a massage, like your body automatically goes into recovery mode. Not run out of space. All right. Hey y'all. Switch my card out. We are done taking out my hair. It took about an hour and a half. It is currently 5.30. Um, I just got a call from the bakery. So we're going to go and pick up. Ooh. We're going to go and pick up Joe's cake in a few minutes. Yeah. I'll see y'all when we make it to um, Publix. I'm here to pick up. A small. Oh yeah, that's the one. Hey y'all, I um, made it to Publix. Um, I did get some footage while I was in there. Y'all, yeah, I almost got mad again because I thought this lady was going to tell me that they still didn't have the cake. But y'all, I'm kind of disappointed. Like I think my, my expectations were a little too high for Publix in terms of cakes but I know the order got messed up because to, uh, to be honest it really didn't get ordered earlier so you know they had at first they had a week so today all they had was like you know um, well technically they had seven to eight hours something like that cake was only $14.99 so I can't say too much but here's the cake y'all try to show y'all up close 
what it looked like. So, and it's about to storm, so I need to hurry to get home. So, here's the cake. And y'all see the stethoscope? Like, what is it? Like, why, why does that look like that? That's bothering me. But maybe I'm just being a little too picky. So, we're about to go home. Um, I'm about to go home, get dressed and everything. It's currently 6.04 p.m. Um, dinner reservations are at 7, so we need to do some light makeup and get dressed. I was going to wear a dress tonight. I was going to wear a dress tonight, um, but it, it started to look like rain. I still want to wear the dress, but at the same time, I want to be comfortable. So... I'm going to look at the weather when I get home. If it's still looking like it's going to rain because it's lightning outside right now, I'm probably going to find something else to wear with some pants or something. But yeah, y'all. I cannot wait to get my nails done next month. Because, yeah. But I think I might try, I think I might try Gel X um, nails while my, while my nails grow back. Because after I took off the S and S I had, y'all, my nails just not have not been right. Like, look at this nail right here. Like, that's crazy. So, I think I'm gonna try out gel eggs. I don't know how much it's gonna cost, but I don't care. But like, hey, y'all. So, um, got home. Currently putting on my outfit, or my outfit's already on but putting on the finishing pieces, bracelets and such. Um, I really didn't have a lot of time to do like a get ready with me. So I'll show you guys the outfit before we head out. But I'm going with my coach tabby. I believe this is the 16. This stuff is so dusty. I did a lot of stuff today, y'all. Like an insane amount of stuff. But I'm always a pretty productive person, so, um, yeah. Actually, I'm going to go with my Clinique Even Better Light Reflecting Primer. And you can usually wear this without foundation, so. And y'all, my new mirror came in the mail, I believe, Friday. I mean, I'm going to put my hair back. Honestly, y'all, I haven't had a, time, a chance to talk to y'all, but I really love where Joe and I are going with preparing for, like, different things that we want to do, like buying a house and, um, you know, moving and everything. We've changed up our budgeting style and everything, so, yeah, I'm excited for everything that's to come. But, yeah, I'm about to head out, so I'll see you guys once we get to the restaurant. Hey y'all, so this was the outfit. I didn't get to show y'all before I left, but I just went with um, my tweed jacket from H&M. And then top, no, the tweed jacket is from Forever 21. And then the top was one of my basics tops from H&M. Uh, and then the bottoms, I got these for Christmas actually, so I don't know where they're from. And then I still got my waist beads on, so I feel like they just make everything look more like, you know, up class. There's no butt. They don't look good. The butt is that I'm ready to lay it down because I am tired. It's been a long week, a long weekend, planning his party and, I mean, not his party. Um, a long week slash weekend, you know, playing his birthday events and everything, but I hope that he is satisfied with everything. We're actually going to do his like birthday um birthday candles um and cake and everything now so let me go out there so we can do that all right guys about to light the candles i'm not taking it away it's not lighting
Yeah. All right. We have the baby candles lit. Oh. Ready? Let's go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. All right, y'all, we're about to eat some cake. Um, I feel like this cake better at least taste good. This man had got some of the stuff. Yeah, what well, yeah, no. yeah. So yeah, he was down there chomping. Oh. Oh, here. Hey guys, it's been a couple days or a day. Today is Monday, July the 22nd. Um, I just wanted to come close the vlog. Kari's here with me. He wants to say bye to y'all. Where you going? You don't want to say bye to the vlog? Oh, this is him saying bye to the vlog. So, yeah, I just wanted to come close the vlog out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog in its entirety. Um, gonna have more home improvements, updates, to come because as I said a lot throughout this video I really want to make this apartment feel more homey and more put together because right now it's just giving I just you know just thrown together and you just bought what you know and it's, it's a point there's a point because you buy what you can afford at that time and that comes with grow and as you grow and you make more money you do all these things you also your space grows with you so i'm not saying like go and spend all your money on new things but in terms of organization like spend your money on things that will benefit you later on and that you will actually love for the rest of your you know your life so yeah hope you guys enjoy it. i'll see you guys in the very next vlog